Hi, everybody. Hello, hello, hello. How's everyone doing? It is, well, seven o'clock my time, so six o'clock central. We are so super excited to have you here with us. There's actually never been a more perfect time to get started. We're even having our own Elepreneur convention party on the weekend. I'm really, really excited about that. If you're just hopping on, if you want to let me know if you're catching this live, if you can type live in the comments below. If you're catching the replay, hashtag replay so I can come back and say hi. If you literally just joined with us today, if you can type new in the comments below so that I can welcome you to our family. I'm excited, so excited. <clears throat> so if you've been following along with us, you kind of know the drill. If you are a guest here with us, you know that we are giving away $25 um, in cash. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to give away um, a second $25 in cash. So I'm going to draw two names. I'm going to choose two names at the end of this. And I'll give you the secret word at the end. That way I'll be able to find it instead of trying to scroll through um, as we go, okay? If you don't know me, I am a Canadian girl. I'm from Niagara Falls. I have four daughters and I have four grandchildren. <laughs> yep, four grandchildren. <laughs> you heard that right. Sometimes I wonder myself, before I started um, doing this in this business, um, I actually was working as a finance manager for about 10 years. I was working 60 hours a week-ish, sometimes more, uh, sometimes a little less, but I worked a lot. Um, and, you know, I thought that I'd be doing the same thing until I retired. Like, I just thought that that was going to be my um my job my you know my retirement and you know the money was good i felt safe and secure and so i never really saw any reason to do anything else you know one of our daughters um is autistic she has adhd she has sensor pro sensory processing disorder and also anxiety so my husband and i had made the decision early on that he would actually stay home with our girls um, and it just made it a lot easier for us if one of us was home especially because i did work a lot um so he stayed home with the kids and that pretty much made me the sole income earner, okay? Um, but it also made, you know, meant that I missed all of, you know, the stepping stones, all of the fun stuff. I missed all of the things with our younger girls growing up. And, you know, my two older daughters, I missed their childhood because I've always worked a lot. It was who I was. And I thought it was the only way to do it. I didn't know any other way, okay? Um, <clears throat> in October 2016, I uh, actually changed the entire course of my life. My mother was diagnosed with terminal cancer. Um, and, you know, I did my best to trying to struggle or trying to juggle family, work, my mom, all of the things that, you know, kind of went on together. And if, in fact, if I could go back, I would choose more, I would prioritize a little differently. I would, would have prioritized more my mom and my family, so I would have had more time with her. Um, but, you know, I had my job, I had my responsibility, and, you know, I felt like I didn't have a choice. I had to go to work every day, you know, and... It, it, the struggles didn't matter. You just, you had to, you know, earn an income and you had to go to work. So I did the things and it became kind of robotic and, you know, you just do it because you have to do it. Well, right after my mother passed, um, I was actually fired from my job. I was fired from my job. They said that they didn't have any reason. Um, and I had prioritized that job um, in my life and sacrifice time with my children and time with my mother before she passed um, for this job, for this this corporate job and, you know, the, the owners and whatnot. Now, that left me with 
planning my mother's uh, funeral service, um, high debt, because I had a high income, so with high income usually came high debt. Uh, Christmas, <laughs> it happened right at Christmas time with four kids and four grandkids. I had zero plan B, no plan B whatsoever. Um, and with no answers, my anxiety and depression was almost unbearable, was almost unbearable, guys. Like, I was lucky to get out of bed. Now, I was lucky because the field that I'm in, the field that I'm in, I was one of the top as far as uh, income earners in the field. So I was able to get a job right away. Very, very thankfully, I was able to get a job right away. But I can tell you right now, I was not happy at that job. I felt like I was sacrificing my time. I felt like I was, because I worked too much. I worked 60 hours a week. And, you know, I felt like, I regretted the time that I didn't have with my mom and I felt guilty for only seeing my kids one day a week because I really only saw them one day a week. I saw them on Sundays. So then everything changed. I got a phone call from a friend of mine at about two o'clock in the morning um, telling me about this business. And let me tell you, I had every excuse Every excuse in the world to say no. Every excuse. I had just lost my mom. Um, I already never saw my kids. I was working 60 hours a week. My anxiety and depression was a nightmare. And on top of all of that, I've never done this before, guys. I have never done this before. But you know what? I decided I'm just going to sign up. And really, I did it to help out a friend to start. I didn't have any idea that this could be anything because like I said, I'd never done this before. So, you know, I didn't know that this could be what it is now. I didn't know what I could expect from, you know, starting this business. So, you know, I signed up and it kind of out of sight, out of mind. I, I went about my kind of robotic life going to work and sacrificing my time um, and my time away from my family. But then the products arrived and I'm telling you that changed everything. That changed everything. Um, you know, not only did it kind of bring me out of the funk and give me more clarity and just make me feel better globally, um, it got me out of that, you know, that funk as far as the depression was concerned. I felt good getting out of bed. And, you know, that kind of a light bulb sort of went on in my head. And the funny thing is, I don't even like coffee. I don't even like coffee, guys. You know who loved coffee? My mother. Coffee was my mother's obsession. So I always have this little joke where I say, my mother led me here. My mother led me here to this because she wanted me drinking coffee because she used to, she, we used to have little arguments all the time about how I need to be drinking coffee. And I'm like, mom, I don't like coffee. And she's like, coffee is life. And I'm going, no, it's not. And then ironically, I end up in this business drinking coffee. And I have now been drinking that coffee for two years and three months, having amazing results with it. And, you know, it really turned my life around. And, you know, all I really did was tell a few people. And people started to notice the difference. People started to notice that I was happier, that I had this, like, glow about me. I wasn't so sad. I wasn't... Um, you know, going to work, coming home, going to bed, going to work, coming home, going to bed. That's basically all I ever did. And, you know, my kids, I didn't really have the role of a mother and it was sad. It was really sad. So, you know, when I started to tell people about this and people started to notice the differences and, you know, I made a post or two on Facebook, which guys, keep in mind, I had like 200 family on Facebook. Like I didn't have time, like I didn't do Facebook. So I had like 200 family on Facebook and, you know, I made a post 
And I literally, I was just consistent in making a post or having a conversation in the cracks of my day. I literally would, you know, on a break or after work, I'd throw up a post and then, you know, I would interact with people in the cracks of my day. So if you really want to make something like this happen, you can. I did it with four kids and working 60 hours a week. And I'm telling you, this was life changing for me on so many levels. Like my story is so long. I really condensed it <laughs> for, for this. Um, and I say I'm a lot. I'm sorry for that. So, you know, I'm really proof with zero experience that anyone can do this. And it's not just because, yes, the product is amazing, but that's not that's not the only reason. It's also because they make it so simple here. It's not easy by any means. You still have to do the work, but they make it so simple. We have so many, you know, amazing groups and processes in place and, you know, so many people to lean on and the support system is phenomenal, like nothing I've ever seen. So they make it simple for somebody like me to be able to do this in the cracks of my day, working 60 hours a week with zero experience and no friends. I did not have friends. I was, <laughs> I was too busy working. You know, I, if I would make a, you know, a, a date to go out with a friend, I'd end up working. So I stopped doing that, you know? So if I can do that, anybody can really do this. No joke. And my business just kept growing and kept growing. And before I knew it, my husband and I were having the conversation of me quitting my job. Do you believe that? So that was the best feeling ever, guys. The best feeling ever. When I handed my keys over to the manager of my company car. The best feeling ever. I can tell you. And, you know, I'm not saying that you're going to be able to quit your job. And I'm not saying that you should, you should quit your job. It's not for everyone to quit your job. But isn't it nice to know that you can have a plan B or you can even have that option? It's nice to know that there is a possibility, even if it's a glimmer of possibility that you can quit, quit your job. The possibility is, is what's there that is powerful and hopeful, right? So now I'm home with my family. I'm so thankful for this business and the products because let me tell you, I'm talking about the business here, but I can't not say this. I've lost 91 pounds using this product, zero diet. My husband's lost 83 pounds using this product. My daughter's lost 30 pounds using this product, okay? Okay, my daughter who's autistic loves the zest lemonade and she, I can't even explain such a calmer energy and she does so well and she loves it. She like, she just loves it. So, you know, in the current situation that we're in now, if I still have my previous job, I would be without work and we would be in really big trouble. But because I now had a plan B, I wasn't left stranded. I have the support systems, I have the friendship network, but I also have a source of income to help when things like this and when things like what happened with my mom and me losing my job, when those kind of things happen, I had something to hold on to. And before I didn't, and I'm so grateful for that. Like I can't even tell you, how grateful I am for that. And with all of the excuses that I had to not do this, those in fact were the reasons that I needed to do it. Because I didn't have the time, I needed to do this. I needed to make time for my family. I needed this. You know, I can sit here all day long and continue to tell you my story or we can help you tell your own. We can help you create your own story. So I look forward to seeing all of you at our Elepreneur party this weekend. So super excited for that. I can't even tell you. I wish I could tell you all the details because it's really exciting. 
but now I'm going to choose two people for our cash giveaway. So I'm gonna watch in the comments, and if you're a guest with us, not an entrepreneur, a guest, I want you to comment party in the comments below. So you comment party in the comments below, and I'm going to choose two people to win $25. So essentially, $25 is all it takes to get started, guys. That's all it takes to get started. So let's see the word party and I'm going to make sure you're a, you're a guest and not an entrepreneur and type party. Party is the word. Party is the word. Come on, party. Let's see it. Party, party. It's a new word. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to choose a couple here. I've got Jody Jones. Okay, Jody Jones, you're gonna wanna message me your PayPal information. And I need another one. Who else, who else is looking to party this weekend? $25 can get you a sign up and you can come party with us. Yeah, the delay is amazing, isn't it, Brittany? Do, do, do. Tink, tink moments, tink, tink moments. Okay, you guys, all right. Thank you so much for watching. I believe we're doing uh, testimonials tomorrow, Deb. We'll get some, um, some testimonials, some photos up. I'll throw my picture up there. So I've got two names, Jody Jones and Tink Moments. Make sure you message me with your PayPal information and we will get you your $25. And thank you very much for watching. And um, I hope you all have an amazing evening. And I hope I see you all next weekend. Bye.